someone who doesn't understand no. Because when I told him no, I don't want to sleep with you. I don't want to talk to you anymore. I booked a hotel. He kept saying about all these kids, about having sex in the bed. I was like, are you okay? About having sex on the Mozambique beach. Um, that his penis is so big. Ah. Stuff like that. It was like, Mula. just funny. We weren't together. I never said I'm interested in dating him. And he's not the same person uh, on the YouTube and in real life. He's not nice. Ah. He's just nice when he needs you. When ah. He needs something from you. He's also so cheap. He makes a lot of money, but he's wearing the same clothes every day, the ah. same pants without wearing underwear, which is disgusting. Yeah, me, and you can smell it. Yeah, 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 yeah. What did the Polina girl say? Hey, Mula, you don't finish. Kenge, you don't finish. So he said, Mr. Marowa say don't like to wear underwear. That is so disgusting. Say Marowa carry her hand put for for her. Marowa carry her uh, put in her hand put for his bola. Say make it touch and say it big way way. Say the bola big way way. He carry he carry her hand carry the girl hand put for inside his bola. Pia. Jesus, Mola, ah, no wonder, Mola, they walk from country to country with Ebola, they do like this, ba, 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 if they look for who we want to chuck that big bola for, ah, and if they look for who we want to chuck bola for, you know, see now, 18 year old girl, now you want to go chuck your big, your big bola, ha, Marwa, they fear God though, they fear God. When I hear this girl, and I was looking at this girl, this girl, this Paulina girl. Paulina, you be liar. I'm coming for you, Paulina. I'm coming. Let me finish Mr. Kenge. <laughs> Let me finish Kenge first because Paulina is a big liar. He's a big, she's a big liar, not him. She's a big liar. Look at the girl, Mola. He's, he's crying for. She's not even pretty. At age 18 years old, she looked like 30 years old. She's not even played at all. She's not beautiful. She's not pretty. Nothing. And Mr. Kenge one by himself there. Mr. Kenge no one we are on the we are again because he don't see 18 year old girl. Now so he carry bola come outside they do and like this banga 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 banga. Now only you get big bola marua. Now only you get big bola. Big bowl away for everywhere, so they, they, they beg people when they want to do vada. Nobody want green. Who want green? Make they use big bowl as scatter in, in Toto in Pecos. Nobody, oh. nobody want agree. Make they use big bowl. Come finish them. Who want green? Now you can't carry your big bowl. Can't hundred, uh, can't uh, one thousand dollars sent to Poland to Polish girl to, 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 to buy ticket. To come meet you in person house in Washington DC. Ha! Mr. Kenge, you two do. You guys, this is crazy. Let's listen before we enter adventures uh, 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 video. Let's listen once again before we go on with this thing. What is, what is this? Ah! I'm someone who doesn't understand now. Because when I told him no, I don't want to sleep with you. I don't want to talk to you anymore. I booked a hotel. He kept saying about all these kids, about ah. having sex on the beach. I was like, are you okay? About having sex on the Mozambique beach. Um, what? That his penis is so big. Uh, stuff like that. It was like, just funny. We weren't together. I never said I'm interested in dating him. And he's not the same person uh, on the YouTube and in real life he's not nice he's just nice when he needs you when he needs something from you he's also so cheap he makes a lot of money but he's wearing the same clothes every day the same pants without wearing underwear which is disgusting for me and you can smell it marwa is someone who doesn't understand now hey when i see who is talking that girl is she pretty is she beautiful 18 years she's supposed to be more beautiful than this but because see she don't they collect bola for very long time i know say mola me when i understand you you guys should understand me i beg 
I know that Mola is not, it's not good. It's not better. Mola is not better. Paulina girl, no be comma, no be oma. <laughs> One dash shall never cease to happen. No. I don't see something for my life. And welcome back to my channel, guys. I greet you all according to your time. You guys are welcome back to my channel. To my returning subscribers, so subscribers, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jenny. Thank you guys for clicking. If you never subscribed to this channel, what are you waiting for? Consider subscribing. Turn on your notification bell so that you'll be getting my updates back to back. Okay, guys, let's dive into the video of adventures. You guys, don't be smart, you know. Adventures explain everything. Even show us some clips during the time that this incident happened. Sometimes, I think two years ago or three years ago, I don't know, but I watched all of that. So, he showed some clip which he failed to show us the side where he's having a conversation with this Porena girl. Where he told, according to Mola, he told Porina, that he should not, she should not go to Africa. That is very dangerous for her. That she might get kidnapped. So now he's trying to uh, um, deny, or I don't know, that he didn't say that. But what my question is, why can't Ivan show us the clip? He showed us other clips where they went to get food from the African restaurant, Swahili restaurant, uh, restaurant in Washington, D.C. He showed us some clips, he showed us some conversations between three of them when the Polina girl arrived and he drove them to his house. He showed us some clips. So my question, my question is, why can't Ivan show us the, the clips where him and Polina girl, we are talking about the uh, African uh, visiting uh, team? Because he said that Porina told him that he, her last boyfriend is from Cameroon. So, and the guy told her that it's very dangerous to travel to Africa. Then the Porina is asking Ivan that this is what my ex-boyfriend said, that to travel to Africa is dangerous. While Kenge Mula is accusing uh, uh, Ivan that... Ivan told Polina not to travel to Africa, that is dangerous. Now, Ivan is saying that it's the girl that told him that her ex-boyfriend told her that to go to Africa is bad. We don't know what is it. We don't know the truth. But for us to find out the truth concerning that particular one, uh, Ivan, you need to show us the clip. After all, you've been showing us the clips of other con conversations. Why can't you show us the clips? Of this particular one, I want you to show us the clip. I'm not, it's not, I don't support nobody. I am a mediator here. I talk exactly the way it is. Okay, let's go there, you guys. The exactly how it is that is where what I'm, I'm not supporting anybody here. I'm not supporting nobody. I say it the way it is. So, Ivan, you failed to show us. I know you have the whole clip. Ivan have the whole clip. For him to show some of this clip, meaning he also have the, the side where he was discussing with Paulina, the Paulina girl. He, he must show us the clip where he was discussing with the Paulina girl about traveling to Africa. Show us the clip so that we will know. Okay? Oh yeah. To take her upstairs. Because Mama is a horn dog. He cannot read the room or at the very least read the mood. He would have realized that Paulina was on chill mode. Not to say that, you know, something was going to happen between them eventually, maybe later. But the way he was acting, he kept shooting himself in the foot and turning her off more and more and more by asking. Mawa, you don't need to keep pushing this girl. She already got on the plane. She flew all the way to the United States. All you have to do is chill. And that's something that he has a problem doing. You know how agitated this guy gets. So what ends up happening is the girl got completely turned off by his repetitive failed attempt to take her upstairs. He just can't wait. So because she's 18 and she's not well traveled, she hasn't been to developing countries yet. It's a completely different way to travel when you go to developing countries, right? Whether you're talking about certain countries in Asia, Africa, or Latin America. 
it is not the same than going to places like, you know, Denmark or Germany. To say that traveling to Nairobi, Kenya, or Yaoundé, Cameroon, is the same as traveling to places where a lot of people have money. Guys, it will be untrue. I'm proud to be from Cameroon. I'm proud to be African. But let's not lie. Let's fast forward. Mm -hmm. Let's fast, fast forward it. <sighs> Hold on, guys. Okay. I'm giving him space with his girl. I'm in my house. I'm in my family room. If he wants space, he goes upstairs with her. He has a whole bedroom. The girl just didn't want to go upstairs. So he, he felt kind of forced to be in the family room. So because of that, and I'm there, and he was later on on the message that he sent me, Mama actually expected me to live my own family room. <laughs> so he can completely take over my house. Ah. Unfortunately for him, I was being a host. I have a guest over. We all talking. I'm chilling. You know, I didn't do anything wrong. It's my house. I can be in my family room if I want to. Exactly. 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 You know, you guys, what happened here is that according to Ivan, Marwa wants a, a Ivan to go upstairs or go to his room so that he will take over. He will take over everything. He will, he will now see this chance to video the whole kitchen, video the Porina girl and the whole environment. And of which Ivan didn't give him the chance. And he went on to challenge Ivan after he see that Ivan is not making a move to live there for them. Him himself, Marwa, went upstairs aggressively, you know, aggressively. He went upstairs and stayed there. So say until, until... Ivan started to, you know, give him a chat from WhatsApp, chatting him, say, bro, are you not coming down? Um, da, 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 da. Let's go there, you guys. He's saying I didn't give you space with the girl. Well, if you want space, get a hotel. Oh. If you want space, go upstairs. That is what I'm saying. That is my point. You want to invite a girl. And you couldn't move out from somebody's house where they host you free of charge. Are you okay, bro? <laughs> bro, are you okay? Is anything wrong? Because me, I, I'm not getting it at all. If it is Marwa, Marwa will say, I'm not feeling it. He's, she's back, but I'm not feeling it. <laughs> Why? Oh, God. You invited a girl. So we are the host you free of charge. You know, get shame. You still want the person that is hosting you, and you still invite a girl. You want the person to leave his living room, room, to leave his living room for you and go upstairs or give you chance in his own house. Hi, hey, who do this guy? Who what give you the authority, the audacity, the authority, the the whole? Oh, you guys, it's too much. And Marwa cannot tolerate this kind of thing. He can't tolerate it in his own house. Look at how Marwa, the fire people that is working for him, he will not even pay him, pay them. He will fire them. He will not pay. He will fire them. Just to take advantage of all these people hustling for their daily business. He will fire them without even paying them. Look at what he went to person house to do in Washington, D.C., Trying to take over someone's house. Who gave him the audacity to do that? Emula, who gave you the audacity? They give you authority. Uh, 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 what? How are they saying it? How are they saying that uh, proverb? Hmm? Eh? I've forgotten what that proverb. I want to use it, but no problem. Let's continue. What kind of space do you want in my own freaking family room? Imagine somebody in your house telling you the way you should behave in your own house. It's absolutely ridiculous. Give, he didn't give me space in my girl. I mean, come on, my what? I know you... you, you I, I never thought you were this ridiculous. Hmm. Really, that night really revealed a part of you that I, I never knew existed. I'm telling you. I knew you. you had issues, but not at this point. 
feel so comfortable into another man's house then you're gonna say he's not giving you space with your girl. I'm telling you, we are you the go they just and give you small door, space. I give you a whole bedroom. That's where you can be alone with her. Imagine. You know? And guys, remember, he told. Hold on, guys. Mara doesn't even know his boundaries. So you don't know your boundary. You are giving somebody authority in his own house, in his home. You are telling the person to go to give you a chance to leave his sitting room for you. For what? Emora, for what? Are you okay? Come on now. Eh, come on now. You guys, hold on. What is going on here? Hold on, you guys. Oh, you know, he's been making all these lies about me. Over, this is not the first one. I, it's exhausting even answering to all of them. It's, it's, it's literally, it's, it's so tiring, guys. It's like every lie he makes is a lie. Everything that comes out of his mouth is a lie. But he's a, he's so entitled. He doesn't even know he's a guest in somebody's home. I'm telling you, he it's doesn't know his boundaries. The young lady to go upstairs he passed him. boundary. All you have to do is just chill and be patient. She's there with you for over a week. Oh. Mawa, you had plenty of time to collect your taxes. You didn't have to do it right then and there. So guys, I was basically left downstairs because Mawa could not handle his invoices. At this point... He has requested for Paulina to go upstairs with him so many times that, you know, the mood is kind of off now between the two. But when he went upstairs, we still didn't know if he's coming down or not. So again, we just sit in the kitchen area, just talking. So once I realized Mao is not coming back down, because when he went upstairs, I thought that he was just going to the bathroom. Once I realized that he wasn't and that he was just going to stay in his room, I, I texted him. So I'm gonna this was hard. He needs to go hide in his room and put himself on. I can't believe you blame me. I was gonna edit. I thought we were just talking. Why do you act like I wanna come between you and her? I really was confused. I thought we were just chilling as friends. It was weird. I said no problem. I do everything I can to make you comfortable. So guys, this is uh the point where I went upstairs. Cause I I was I was boiling because I was feeling like man, he's rude to the girl. You know what I'm saying? He's acting so aggressive towards her, keep making these requests to go upstairs. She's saying no. I am in the family room talking. And now he's telling me I need to tell her I need to go upstairs. I need to make lies about me being tired or whatever. I just want them to Whoa. welcome both of them in the house. Like, what's wrong about me entertaining in the family room? That's where I'm supposed to be, right? That's where I hang out all the time. So I went upstairs and I told him, Mama, what is your problem? And he didn't say anything. He was just kind of like, you know, just looking like that. I'm okay, man. I'm okay. So when I asked him, are you okay, man? He said, I'm okay, man. I'm okay. And that's when he told me I should go to my room. Face to face, he said that. You know, that I should go in my room so ah. he can be alone with her. And I lost it. Because I've tolerated so many things before. But now him telling me that I need to leave my own family room and go in the bedroom, that was just too far. And I screamed. <laughs> And I say, how dare you talking to me like this? How dare you? Because he was just crossing. <laughs> imagine. In my ugly voice, imagine. Ivan couldn't hold it again. Where Marwa? After they waited for him to come downstairs, he didn't. Ivan now went upstairs to call him. Marwa, are you not coming down? This is the second time, mind you. That time, Marwa now lose himself. He now said, go to your room and leave me and my girlfriend alone. That is when Ivan shows now lose his mind. <laughs> he did not get loosed. He now shout on him. In my own house, are you telling me what to do? Are you commanding me what to, we have to sit down in my own house? We are hosting you? Are you out of your mind? You does not know your boundary? You guys, if it were you, how will you feel? How will you feel when somebody you host is telling you to go to your room? Imagine. And at this point, Mr. Kenge, Never even he never even know that ah this is a huge mistake. He cannot even recognize his mistakes. He cannot even recognize his fault. That's ah this is wrong. 
I shouldn't have invited this girl at this place for the first time. All right, guys, this is where I'm going to end this video. If you never subscribe to my YouTube channel, Jenny Blog Media, to this moment, what are you waiting for? Join the team, Jenny Blog Media team. Join us, subscribe, turn on, turn on your notification bell so that anytime I upload any video, you'll be notified until we see in the next video. Ciao, 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 guys.